So. What's good? What's going on, everybody? You already know who this is. And it's definitely your favorite sofa child. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. So I come at you once again here at the PEG Podcast. That's positive energy generation. Because we that for life. We choosing the positive through the negative. We positive, not pussy. I'm going to always say it. Because some of y'all be trying to play, you feel me? But anyway, uh. We're going to get right back to it. Anyway, so you already know I'm in my bag, right? With the hottest artists around the world. I mean, around the world. Hottest artists that you can ever find. As well as public figures, influencers here to show you that you are not alone and you can do it. So you know I had to go dig in my bag just a little bit, you feel me? And you would have never guess who had to pull up on me. I got that one and only. You know, the grind time. Everything 1K. I got my boy Gino in the building. How you yeah. feeling? What's up, what's up? Y'all know what it is, man. Uh-huh. Tell the package when we let them have it. They slack and we never lack it. Hey. 25, they won't take no breaks for <laughs> longer, even when they ain't. ABMBTA is grind time 1K. Y'all Everything, man. Everything. Yeah. And if you ain't really with it, you're going to be with it for like this. I'm with it, you feel me? So oh, before yeah. we get started, just go ahead and get it out the way. Follow. I'll you know wait. What I'm saying? Yeah, man, y'all check it out, man. Instagram, y'all follow, man. GT1K all day. That's G-T-O-E-L-N-E-1K all day, man. You know all day. Yeah, you know, I usually make y'all wait. But you know what I'm saying? He went on and gave it to you. So uh, follow. You have no excuses. I don't know what to put. Just follow. Stop crying. Follow. All right? Nah, yeah, now y'all are wasting enough of our time. We can really get back in our bag. So like I said, we're going to talk about the song that he had featured for artists of the week. You already know my name is a vibe, and if you have not already, go check it out because he's live. So man, how you doing, bro? How you feeling? Man, I'm good, man. I'm blessed. I can't complain. You know what I'm saying? Everything <laughs> is up right now. Like, no, I, man, if I could explain it, I would, but I can't. I can't. Like, you know what I'm saying? The feeling is just like unbelievable. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. just time after time is just getting better and better. You know, so. That's the best part about it. Like, you know, even the down times, it'd be like, it's just a journey. You yeah, know yeah, yeah. You got to fall in love so, with the journey, man. Ups, yeah. ups and the downs. Ups and the downs. You know what I'm saying? and the lessons, you know what I'm talking about? Right. Definitely seeing you grow. And um, for the people that just maybe not know, they just, you know, not on social media, you know what I'm saying? Maybe they just, they lame. They in the rock. They under the rock like, like Patrick, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. They, they, they never heard of Gino One Everything 1K. They've never heard of it. Hey, let them know who is Gino, bro, and why everything got to be 1K. You feel me? Grind man, time. You know, all these people talking about is, man, they 100, 100. I don't rock with 100, people, <laughs> man. I, I really don't rock with 100 people because people be talking about they 100, but they do some old flower-ass shit. You for know real, for real. But excuse my name, but you know nah, what I'm saying? Nah, be but, real with the people. But yeah, they do just do some flower shit, man, and I, I don't be with that, you know. And so that's why I came up with that 1K shit, because I keep it all the way G, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, not for you know real. So everybody be like, man, G, yeah, I'm going to keep it G all the day. <laughs> just, just holler at me, man. I'm going to tell you what it is and what it ain't, you know what I'm saying? And I ain't saying I'm perfect or nothing Nah, like ain't nobody that. perfect. Exactly, you know what I'm saying? Because we all humans, and you know what I'm saying? We we creatures of habit. Yeah. So if you don't know, you don't know. But it's up to you to want to figure it out. You know what I'm saying? No, it's and you want that knowledge. And if you knew better, you do better. You, you know knew better, saying? you do better, so, man. And if you know, it's it's on you. you don't yeah. be trying to hold it back like ah oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm just let it roll. Nah, nah don't go with the flow. You know, you know what I'm saying? Don't go with the flow. Be the flow. You <laughs> yeah. know what I'm saying? Be the flow. So I like keep it. it all the way one k. You know what I'm saying? All day, every day. You know what I'm saying? Twenty five eight. We don't take no breaks. Ain't but, no breaks. Oh, yeah, and if I didn't let you know, man, it's GrindTime1K.com, man. So tap in GrindTime1K.com. Right now. Right there. You feel it's me? right there. Yeah, tap into that, man. <laughs> yeah, definitely but, tap in, man. Yeah, and like, man. Yeah, like how you said that you're like, I don't like the 100. You feel yeah, me? Like, yeah. everybody's like, I'm 100. But you're not. You're not even a quarter. You're not even, you you're, not, you're not even a dime nah, right now, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they be on there. I'll be, so I, I just be peeping game. You know what I'm saying? A lot of yeah. people be talking. I'm like, all right, that's cool, but. You know what I'm saying? But you still, your character don't match. Yeah, you, know you 100, but it's not match. matching up with it. Exactly. You, you so, a thousand, yeah. you got to, 
you got to go real, really be a thousand. You feel me? So that's what I'm saying. So that's like, uh, if that's a hundred, well, I'm going to be one thousand. Fuck that. Y'all, <laughs> hell no. Nah, you got to get on this level. Try Ten times better than you, you know on everything. That's no, real. That's real. I'll talk. You know what I'm saying? So, I like that. And that's how that really kind of came about. So that's why. And then the whole slogan, like, why 1K? You know what I'm saying? Because I was told to keep it G. You know what I'm keep saying? Keep it G, man. And the whole way. times I was told to keep it G. So, you know what I'm saying? When they be like, man, why why you be talking about 1K all the time, man? So all the way one. Look, yeah. I'm, I'm past 100. I'm, I'm a thousand past this thing, you man. feel me? Everything 1K. 100, and I'm grinding, you feel me? Grind you know, time. Right. So if you don't know I'm grinding and I keep it 1,000, then, you know bro, you sleep. Yeah. You it? It's like... It's hey, explain, I can explain it to you, but it really don't mean no explanation. They sleep nah, for real. Hayden Cubs are creeping on them, but they can't sleep till <laughs> they stop sleeping on them. Wake your ass saying? up, bro. For real, dog. Let the people know, man. Like, now they got a little bit about who you are. Um, Why you decide to, to be artist, you know, show your art? Because there's different ways to have art. You can do it in painting, you can do it in music. You yeah. chose music. Why music and why you wanted to put that out there to the people? Honestly, uh, it really it, it chose me. You know what I'm saying? Mm, I, uh, I, I like really um, jumped into it because my brother, man, my my brother was so awesome at that he was doing his thing, and I kind of started it with him. It really, I was really kind of like behind the scenes, you know. Yeah. yeah. And uh, he was like the artist, and he was doing his thing, and he kind of was like, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna be on the manager, but I'm gonna choose to be the face, and this, this, and that. Yeah. And this is right before his passing. He ended up. R.I.P. The bro, man. You know what I'm saying, R.I.P. Silas, man. R.I.P. Silas, man, my bro. Man, R.I.P. Silas, man. Long live Silas. No, big facts, man. Big but, facts. Um, yeah, so he kind of, he, he not kind of, he inspired me to really do this because when he died, I kind of just took the torch and was like, I'm going to keep it going because we had it all set up before he passed away. It was like, it was, everything was coming together, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And just suddenly he was taken from me and they was like, damn, I, at one point in time, I didn't even want to do music no more. It could be like that you know too, especially when you mourning like that, bro. You yeah. want to give up. Yeah, I just was like, I was so down and now I went through a whole, like, breakdown you know what i'm saying so but um i pulled myself out of it eventually you know what i'm saying and uh i, I just took it and ran with it, it was like i right, i'm gonna rep it and i'm gonna push it and go forward with yeah. it so and then you know that out of that came grind time you know what no, i'm saying face. i like that it's grind <laughs> yeah it's grind so yeah y'all thought i was here before you know i'm here now saying? yeah really? so and uh, ever since then it was long little silence you know no, what i'm saying real, long little bro and man grind time 1k you know what i'm saying actually it, it ended up, it started as grind time because we was just it was like what what like what sums up what we doing like what we doing right now and like every time we look at it we was grinding every yeah, time it was grinding, so yeah. it was like man it's grind time so that's what it is so i kind of put it all together you know what i'm saying like just, i came up with it out the blue kind of like i was sitting down with my kinfolk you know what I'm saying? My Kim for KT, the great, y'all. Yeah, shout out to KT, the great. Yeah, you feel me? Y'all be sleeping on my bro, man. Yeah. Yo, they, it's all good, though. <laughs> yeah, shout out to my <laughs> Kim for man. It got to be hard, man. Um, you said um, that it was it, it had hit a toll on you when you lost your brother. Yeah. And major, you felt like major. you didn't want to continue to do music. So, yeah. you know, there could be somebody right now that's going through it. So what kind of advice would you give them if they want to, whether it's music, whether it's cooking, whether it's drawing, and they got that passion, but that person that inspired them, their brother, their sister, their mom, their dad, they lost them, and they just can't seem to find their way. What advice would you give them to keep pushing forward? I ain't going to lie. Find, find yourself. That's man, for sure thing, for sure. Because yeah. I ain't going to lie. It took me a while. Like, my brother died in 2016, and it took me... I ain't gonna lie, it took me years. Like, I kind of, I could say I kind of got hold of myself slightly uh, around 2018. I, but honestly, I ended up going to a mental hospital. And so it kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Amen. Yeah, it like, I broke down like completely. Like, I was like, everything was on. It was just like, all I seen was red. You know what I'm saying? Everything like was murder. Like, no, I couldn't understand life because he wasn't. He wasn't in those streets or nothing like that, so I couldn't understand how he could. He had a big heart. He was just so yeah. giving. And yeah. So it, it took me, like, for a loop. Like, damn, not him. Like, like if I hope people, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know me saying? first, but him. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because they were like, everybody, you know what I'm saying, thought I was going to be gone because how I was living, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I was out there. So it was like, 
for him to go, it was like a wake up, like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Anything can happen. Anything like, can you know happen at any the, time. He could be the you? purest person, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, but, so I'm trying to figure out life. So I, I went through a mental breakdown, ended up going to the uh, mental hospital and shit. And um, I ended up, yeah, meeting my wife 2018. And by hey. that time, uh, by, that, uh, by that time, I was kind of like finding myself, like, okay, I want to, I don't want to be, this person no more. Yeah, I yeah. I want to be like, you know what I'm saying, somebody that bring everybody together. Yeah. You know what I'm I want to like live a righteous way, you know what I'm saying, just really just I, uh, rewrite my wrongs, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can definitely relate to that. So, definitely relate to that. Because I felt like I did, not so, that I did so much bad, but like, I mean, it was bad probably to certain people at that time, but you know what I'm saying, yeah. it was more so like I, I felt like I did what I needed to do at the time. But not knowing, you know what I'm saying? What not knowing that I ain't have to live like that, I ain't have to be yeah. like that, you know what yeah. I'm saying? So it's I guess maturing just, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's all this elevated, growing, you know, yeah. learning from the past, learning from the mistakes. Um and that's like I said, pushing past uh, uh losing a loved one is not easy, whether it's brother, sister, like I said, mom, dad, that's something that everybody fear, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Being by yourself, that person you used to talking to them every day, yeah, and it's like, you know. I ain't talking to you today, and I, I, I accidentally call you, and all I hear is your voicemail, it's yeah. like, now I'm going back down this hole, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And then, like you said, mental health is very important, and a lot yeah. of us go through mental health, but we don't speak on it, and that's just yeah, how we was so. raised. We're not raised to speak on our emotions because he's like, yo, get your feelings off your sleeve. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Like, uh, that time like, get your feelings off your but sleeve. sometimes you need to, you know. You do, you, know you need to. I, don't, I ain't gonna lie to say I talk to people like that, but uh, I do find peace in talking to myself or talking to Happy God. Yeah, you know yeah. Or a higher being. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But um, that, that, that helped me a lot. And then finding, you know what I'm saying, music, I feel like really... It's like a therapy to me, you know what I'm saying? Cause it is, it I is. Did, I'm, I like my first uh, after my brother died, um, and me not wanting to do music and all that. Uh, it took some time, but music ended up, you know what I'm saying, bringing me out of that that funk. Like you know, what yeah, I'm saying? Even yeah. Even though the first things I recorded was like some uh <laughs> some things that you know what I'm saying just I'd rather not be you know what I'm like you know me going through like what that. I was going yeah, through I was going through some emotions so you know what I'm saying so but um that that helped me like kind of you know what I'm saying overcome that and be like okay you know what yeah. I'm gonna push this for I'm him you know what I'm saying and then and from that point on and it was like let me do this music and 2018 actually became like one of my big breaks in music. Um, I was on uh, one of the only artists that I know of uh, doing South by Southwest that was on um, TV, yeah. and cable channels in Austin. Hey. And on the podcast broadcast over the US and the UK. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my boy Flynn. He Let go. Out. You know what I'm saying? TV Put it in words right there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and that was like my big, like, kind of breakout. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I ended up. Uh, making a song called Notice Me. So y'all check out that. If we check it out. Platforms, you know what I'm saying? Check it out. Um, so that kind of kind of pulled everything up. And then, you know what I'm saying? Friday, that's when Grind Time came about and Grind Time 1K. And then 2020, we did the block party uh, in Colleen. Yeah, you went KT the grade? Yeah, I remember y'all told yeah, me about that. So that, that caught the attention of uh, the Colleen City Council, you know what I'm saying, and uh, UPC. And so, yeah, and that, it was on. And that was, like, really my uh, first yeah. time getting paid for a performance. Yeah, yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And Makes I felt good. like then, I was like, oh, yeah, I'm an artist from now on. It's <laughs> yeah. on. It's, See, oh, this was going to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm diving in. So I went ahead <laughs> first into it. So, yeah. And yeah, and then, and this has been great ever since. I ain't even gonna lie, it's been getting better and better ever since. Like, you know what I'm saying? A couple of hiccups, you know, but yeah, it was everything. It was like a learning experience. It was. It, it is. It, it's been so great. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? It's been awesome. I can like, definitely see it, bro. Really. You definitely had a journey. Like I said, when we first been with you, KT, we all have grown and elevated yeah, since then. So yeah. it's like. Then you gotta keep going, man. Like if, they, yeah, if you can do sure. that in that little bit amount of time, just imagine ten years yeah. from now. You know what I'm saying? Like me? where you gonna be? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be somewhere. <laughs> like you said, I was talking about TV. I'll be on yeah. networks, broad networks. I'm gonna be on everything. You feel yeah. me? So definitely keep going. And one thing I really wanna touch more on is um, before we get into the song, is that you, morning, 
it's very hard. You feel me? Like to yeah. mourn when you lose somebody and then to try to be okay. And that's like yeah. the hardest thing to do to keep going because life never stops. You know, nah, it, it, it makes you feel, on. yeah, it keeps life going. And then yeah. uh, you talked about, like, you, you met your wife, right? Shout out to Nikki, you feel me? Yeah, Shout out. Too real. But, yeah, check it out, man. Yeah, that's real. She got those pipes, bro. But um, what what are some experiences that y'all had to go through to get over? Because, you know, these emotions that you was trying to get over. Because it's like time, that timeline that you said was, like, right there on each other. And yeah. you know, meeting her. So you had to, you know, cleanse yourself. You had to get Dang, over some things. Know. You had to nah, redo this and redo that. So what are some things that and you would say y'all had, to, y'all had to fight through to get to this point? And cold part about it, me and my wife met on my brother's birthday. You know uh, what I'm saying? So uh, you, you can just imagine how emotional was I crazy. was on that day. It's crazy. You know what I'm saying? Like, not actually like, man, we have talked, but uh, like she pulled up on me that day. And from that day on, she ain't left my side. Dang, bro. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Like, magical, from, bro. That's, that was that's 2018. Wild. You feel yeah, me? Yeah, this from 2023. That, I mean, we, you we feel do, me? When I say we do everything together, everything. every. Thing we work together right yeah, now. Yeah, no, I can definitely you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, everything. We do music together, like everything. You know, yeah. everything. You feel me? So, like that day was just like amazing within itself. It was just like a turning point within my life because I was like, and I presented some to her, like this is how I'm living. This is where I plan on going with my life. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And this is what I'm trying to be. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And if you up for it. She signed yeah. this contract. Let's yeah, go. She's like, I'm, here. I'm with you. You know I what I'm like saying? That. And then, yes. And y'all still together to this day, bro. It's, it's so beautiful. Yeah. Um, Not many people, well, pe- there's marriages out there. You got, you got people that will have a solid marriage. You got people that has weird marriages, I call them. I call them weird marriages. You feel me? So in a marriage, what would you say would be the hardest thing in the marriage between two people? The hardest thing? Uh... Understanding, mm. understanding. And you hit that right on the nail, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he hit that right you know on the nail, like understanding. Yeah, because you could have, you could communicate all all day, every day. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't understand each other, then yeah. it's not gonna go nowhere. Yeah, it's like speaking you know two different saying? languages. You're like, huh? yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Until you fully understand each other, or at least you know what I'm saying, be able to agree to disagree, mm-hmm. or like see it from different perspectives Point of views, yep. yeah you know what i'm saying yep. then it's it's gonna be a constant tug of war you know what I'm there's saying? two people yeah. doing this the whole time yeah. and it, honestly y'all saying the same thing but it's like and it's, like you said there's no commu- there's communication yeah. but there's no understanding yeah so you gotta be understanding nah, and you gotta understand sure. what they went through what they come from and lingo is different too you feel me like nah, yeah the yeah, lingo yeah, could be different definitely that's yeah. one thing i love my wife like for a while we would get it to it here and there, but it'd be like, why are we saying the same thing? Yeah. And I'm like, but why you say it like that? Why you say it like that? But why you different, have to say yeah, it like that? And it's you like, know what? we from different places. Exactly. You come from different places, different, you know what I'm saying, environments or whatnot. Big facts. So, you know what I'm saying, something might come out differently to you. So Yeah, you know like, like, uh, like if I scrub on you right now, if I get close to you, you like, you may not take that, you know, take that way. You're like, oh, she's just close. But yeah. like people from New York, you get kind of close. They're like, well, what you trying to do? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, What's up? Like, like, I'm just trying to get close to you to tell you something. Yeah. But them, they like, hey, we finna knock and we finna bust. It's like, <laughs> hold on, I'm, I'm hospitality over here. It's yeah. not that. So once we got to That's understand all. like, oh, yeah. you rowdy, rowdy because you New York. Yeah. I'm down South hospitality. But we saying yeah. the same thing. It's just you saying it direct. And I'm like, exactly, I'm saying it to exactly. care about your family. Ah, and that's yeah. where everything started, like, get clear. You feel me? Yeah. And you sitting there thinking, exactly like, damn, time. the whole time I could have I could have exactly. had understanding yeah. instead of just communicate. Yeah. You know so, what I'm and, and the best thing is patience. You know, mm-hmm. to have patience mm-hmm. with it because patience will take you a long way. It will because you ain't got no patience. You definitely gonna understand. You're going to nah, be going nah. straight to the door. I'm gone. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because you ain't got, yeah, that, um, that, uh, no, uh, you ain't got no understanding that was yeah. so off top. You just going to go off a of reaction because, yeah. you know what I'm saying, at the moment, you feeling a, fir- a certain type of way. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's all because so you don't like, understand. Like, that feeling yeah, is feeling. not a real feeling. It's a it's a trauma feeling because you yeah. thinking, yo, she going to react like that or this is what yeah. they saying. It's like, no. Nah. Just yeah. ask him, what are you saying? The ego pride. <laughs> yeah, you know ego pride the way. That, that has no place in a relationship for one yeah. day. Oh, you know what I'm saying? And just, and if, and no, don't nobody know and don't nobody <laughs> tell you, ego and pride has 
no, no place, place in a relationship, in a relationship at because all. <laughs> you know, I'm telling you, you're going to lose every time. No, big facts, big you're facts, gonna, man. And your feelings going to be hurt. You know what I'm saying? Your feelings going to be hurt. All the time. You know what I'm saying? So you better be secure. Oh, that's the one. You better be secure with yourself. You know what I'm saying? So, oh, yeah, insecurity. That's one thing. Mm. If you insecure... You know what I'm saying? Y'all let man. that go. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta face that part of you. You know what I'm saying? But like I said. I, honestly, I feel like, uh, and if you do have those issues, those problems, a strong relationship will help you overcome those. Yeah. You know what like to validate. You know what I'm yeah, saying? It, it's nothing saying? wrong. Like, um, to validate, that's one thing I had to learn too is like, it's nothing wrong with validating insecurities. You know what I'm saying? Because coming from other relationships, that's just what was built long term. Yeah. You come in doing something different, they ain't going to see different because it seems the same, but it's not the same. That's a deception. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Exactly. So exactly. I got to earn yeah. my trust with you off the deception and let you know yeah. it's just a deception. It's not real. Yeah. And I got to be know. patient with you because you coming from different than what I'm trying exactly. to give you feel me so that's what's up I got past traumas we all got that you know what I'm saying past so, trauma childhood yeah. traumas family yeah. you know what people I mean? we've been in so relationships that, with whether yeah. it's cousins you or we your girl yeah. like bro yeah a lot so that plays a part you know what I'm saying so but it's all about uh growth and maturity you know what I'm saying it, it, and it comes along the way and you're the not journey. telling them no wrong you feel me like i feel like y'all going through that right now he's not telling you no wrong like real it's talk like running. you can have a toxic relationship that that's 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 not what the way of the world is no more. Like you can be yeah. so much better. Like like he said, understanding to communicate and not to communicate. Just like you just yeah. sitting there going back and forth, you never go get no understanding. Nah, but take your so. time, be patient, and then you can take a break, come back to the same conversation. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing wrong with giving them time because those insecurities took time to build. You know exactly, what I'm saying? Exactly. So you definitely giving good facts. And um, they're gonna jump into the song that you had chose for uh, artist of the week. Uh, yeah, it's called so. something special, yeah. you know, and I really like that. So I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you opportunity to go ahead. I, even though I just, you know, I jumped the gun and I kicked the uh, bell buzz kill for this. Go ahead and shout the song out and then explain to them why you picked that song. Nah, for sure. This here is that something special, you know. I picked this song, you know, because um, I actually uh did this song. It wasn't even, it didn't start as a song. It was just something that I had kind of got a beat and um. It was something that I had took a took a pay cut, and I was working to work every day, and it was something that it just kept me going every day. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So I was said every day, and then I guess uh, I ended up recording it, and dude was like, "Hey man, you should. That's a song, man. You need to put that on a project." Was he like, was going through so he's yeah, like, I you know feel what I'm saying? Because yeah, it was real <laughs> inspirational. It's like a real positive nah, it is. So and I was like, "Nah, yeah, this is something I really just was saying to get me through." The day, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I will walk to work every day saying this and walk back, you know what I'm saying, and just say this same thing over and over. Yeah. And yeah. It, it just really kind of helped me get through it because it was like a depressing time. It was like, dang, so much things was going wrong. But it was really like, it was falling apart to piece together. Mm -hmm. You know what Sometimes I'm saying? be like that you got to fall Man, apart to go together. What? It was, and, man, and I look at back at it now, it was like, it was, yeah, it was, it was all perfect. It was story. already written. Yeah. Whether you knew it or not, you like, <laughs> you in the moment, so you're like, bro, I could have sworn I paid for this and I paid for, I just want to do yeah. better. But I just, you, you, yeah, you did it. You did better. Yeah. Now you got to clean your slate and then come back with something different, you feel me? Nah, so sure, I like that. Sure. That was very something special. I would like that. Um, yeah, You know, what's up? I like, I like, I like that song with you and your wife. It's all I ever wanted, bro. All, all right. I yeah. ever wanted. Hey, it's, nah, it's, yeah. Uh, and that actually well. set out the tone <laughs> for everything like that. Michael Watts Holler does it, you know what I'm saying? All that like so it, it really like like set the our career on fire, like nah, that fixed. that one song, you know what I'm saying? And it's been on ever since. Then all over there. Like being my yeah. just like listen like, it's like that's our favorite one. But like, oh, yeah. it's, 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 it's real it. life stuff. Like it is it's something like people go through on a daily basis, just those those thoughts and those feelings, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So it's like just letting people know I, I relate to you. I know your lifestyle. I'm, I'm yeah, I can, like, I can relate. I can relate. Me, you in the same boat. You're not yeah. alone. We may not be in the same situation, yeah, but we're going you know through similar saying? things, exactly. and you can relate. And that's what I feel like real music is about. We can get on the track, and I can get on the track, hype you up all day, and say nothing. Yeah. I can say nothing and just hype you up. But when you get done hyped up, where you going home to? <laughs> your mind drifting off too, bro. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Because that's what you're not telling. Yeah. Like, no, you know what I'm saying? You're thinking about what what's going on and and what's really 
what reality is, what life oh, big is, face, big what's face. happening to you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So when you're done feeling all good about yourself, and, you know what I'm <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you really come down to what life is and what's going on. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You what facing you got it. To get through that. Uh -huh. you know what I mean? And you need that. You need that something to get you over that hump. You do. Like I like Wednesday. that. Definitely. <laughs> it's like a Wednesday. Like yeah. hump day. Yeah. You're going to get me through it. It's halfway through the week. Yeah, you got to get through the rest that. of the week. Yeah. Nah, I like that. Definitely y'all stay tapped in. If you have not already, follow. You got my man information, man. Grindtime1k.com. So, uh, Grindtime1k. Go check it out. I promise you. You're going to love it. You're going to feel a vibe. Go rock with it. Um, but the song that you like I said pick was very dope. So they'll be able to listen to it be a, with the uh the podcast itself. <clears throat> but what are some future projects? Well, before we get to the future projects, what is one project out of all the projects, I guess, from the new projects that you've been working on? What is some projects that yeah. you worked on and was really, really dear to you, but it was very hard to get that project out because mm -hmm. of emotions, because of situations, because of whatever you was going through. What project was that? Sweet pain, man. Y'all be mm -hmm. checking mm -hmm. for that, man. It's coming out <laughs> South by Southwest. Oh, it's about to be live, you feel me? Check it out, man. March, we coming up with it. Sweet, Sweet pain, pain. yeah. And I also got a documentary coming with it. You know what I'm saying? So uh, that's that's basically like the hardest project. I, I have been working on it, really. Like all the songs were kind of built up from the time my brother had passed away mm -hmm. or, or the af aftermath or whatever. Yeah. So it was like, it was real emotional, you know what I'm saying? Just putting these songs together and then having to go forward without yeah. them. Yeah, you know what the I'm moving saying? forward so, is the hardest part. Yeah, so, and I just, that's what, and that's really what the documentary is about as well, you know what I'm saying? So y'all be looking for Sweet Pain and the documentary Sweet Pain, you know what I'm saying? And that's, that's yeah, it's that that's the hardest thing I ever had to really experience. So, you know what I'm saying? The songs, you could you could hear it in the songs just, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Actually, all I ever wanted to be on there, so y'all check yeah, it out. Yeah, go check it out. So, you know what I'm saying? But, um, yeah. That would be the hardest pain, one, Sweet Pay. Um, and what did you say because of the emotions and everything? Like with that project that he was trying to give out, you had to you had to tap into a place yeah. that you didn't want to go to. You feel I me? I really, yeah, I really didn't. You know what I'm saying? It's, uh... I ain't gonna lie, that's why it's called Sweet Pain, though, because um, with that pain came something, um, something special. Like, like Sweet. I said, I, I met my wife, and we've been yeah. rocking ever since. And, um, you know what I'm saying, even on my bad days, I still feel like... Oh, well, they better not fuck with you, because you know nigga gonna pull up on <laughs> you. You be like, bro, who is that? <laughs> oh, 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 don't, yeah, don't, don't nah, do me. Yeah, I'm tired. She coming <laughs> with it, you dig? You know what I'm saying? She's something heavy behind me, so... <laughs> Uh, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, with that pain though, it um it, it built me up and now it's something special. You know what I'm saying? Thanks. So yeah, check out that song. Check it out. You got special. to, man. Especially if you're yeah. going through something, you never know if this song can reach you. Cause that's what it's all about, to let you know that you're not alone. <clears throat> somebody will relate to you and somebody will be there for you, you know. And you just gave out your social media, so for the people in the back. They want to just shut up, bro. Like, be quiet. <laughs> bro, well, just go ahead and set the social media back out because they was talking. They ain't hear you. Hey, y'all check me out, man. On IG, that's GT1K all day. GT1K all day. G-T-O-N-E-K all day. Right you feel me? Follow. Oh, all right. Man. Well, stop being creepy oh, and yeah, follow my boy. Don't forget that. Grindtime1K.com. <laughs> And don't forget that Gino One K. That's on the Facebook. You know, yeah. I don't really rock the Facebook like that. You can catch me more on IG, but I just put that out there anyway. Gino One K. You know what I'm saying? And GT One K all day. That's hey, IG all day, like man. So, um, you know, I was I was gonna ask crazy questions, and you know, before we get off, and I know you like to you like to get you know, sit, I like to say the magic potion. You know, I like to take some magic potion and make myself feel good, get into my oh, zone. Man. You feel me? So, if you can have any strain. Of the magic potion, what that strain would be, and what would you name your magic potion? Mm. What would I name my magic? So that's crazy. I was just kind of talking about this <laughs> the other day. Um, you know what I'm saying? I'm diving into something right now. I'm kind of uh -oh. pursuing some things right uh -oh. now. You know what I'm saying? I got something in the mix. So I want to, you know what I'm saying? I got a little few things in the mix, but uh, I would call my thing uh, one kog. One kog. That's what you know. OG, Everything that, that, I do is you know what I'm 1K. Saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? 1K OG. That sounds like it's going to have you in the couch. 
Yes. Uh, <laughs> like real talk, yes, you gonna uh, be in the couch. That's my potion right there. <laughs> I, that guess I get that one KOG, you know what I'm saying? It's over with. Hey, it, it's over with, you know what I'm saying? I'm in the zone, in right. the zone. You know, when you're in the zone, you got to have food with you. You know, you, oh, yeah. like, man, I got to give you something because that sounds like going to have me hungry. Yeah. So if you can name a burger that go along with your strings that people can tap it, what would that burger be called? It had to be, let me see. That's that 1K all day. Yeah, yeah. That's that 1K all day. You know, I got to have the... Uh, Gotta come with the mustard automatically. Uh oh. Uh oh. Gotta have the mustard. Whatever it has, it's gotta have the mustard. Okay. Double up the fries. Double man. up the fries. You know what I'm saying? The veggies off top. Off the top. You know what I'm saying? Need some of them good old jalapenos and them pickle peppers. Pickle know? peppers, bro. That sound, that sound like everything that's 1K. That's what that it does sound me. like. That's just me. You know what I'm saying? But that sounds like a good old burger. So, like, if you see that anywhere, it's his. I right, and I would yeah. jump you. I would really jump you. <laughs> man. I, I tell you, you <laughs> oh, everything. But it's definitely a blast, style. man. <laughs> have you on? And again, this part of the uh, segment is definitely being sponsored by Crooked Force, man. Crooked Force, go check out my peoples out there in Harker Heights, man. They gonna serve you up some food. So whether you hungry right now oh, yeah. or hungry tomorrow, they gonna serve you up. Look. I recommend the chopped cheese and the dream big burger. So go check out my peoples and tell them the Shark sent you, all right? Shout out to Crooked yeah. Forks. Shout out to Dream Big Studios. My man Tone in the building. And you already know I got to say shout out to my boy Gino. Grind time. Everything yes. 1K. For actually come and sit down with me. Okay. Pull up on it, man. It's love when you got family in the building. You feel me? All the way. All the way, man. So if everybody was listening right now and they just, oh, my God, they just tapped in and just didn't get nothing. Because I don't know how you just didn't get nothing. You just here. What would you say to inspire somebody in 15 seconds if you can impact one person a day? What would you say and what would that message look like 15 seconds ago? Hey, man, go for what you know, mm. you know what I'm saying? Mm. Always seek the education, you know what I'm saying? Acknowledge yourself, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. And don't stop. Don't stop because, you know what I'm saying, if you stop, then you'll never know. Keep going. You don't want that regret. That regret. regret, yeah. So just keep going, you know what I'm saying? You never know what's on the other side. On the other side, you never know if you're right there. You never know. Perfect. Keep networking, too, as well, you know what I'm saying? Because networking builds your network. Mm-hmm. Your net you know work is saying? your net worth. You feel so, me? That's what they say. Go That's what they what say. Know, man. Go for it. And always want better for yourself. Always don't want be better. Don't scared to, you know what I'm saying, want more for yourself. And don't feel bad for wanting more for yourself. I, I feel you know like that's something we a lot, a lot of people go through. Like, I want to do this for myself, but I don't want to. I want to I wanna yeah. seem selfish. Yeah, they you know don't want people to look at them different because they, they don't want to be the same way. Nah, yeah. nah, like you don't have to, you know what I'm saying? Just because I'm comfortable being in the hood, that don't mean I have to live in the hood. Yeah, I don't have to life. stay there. It, it doesn't you know make me saying? it doesn't mean forget where I'm from. You know, I was yeah. just actually talking to my wife earlier about that. Like I had a friend, I was like in in here recording, he wanna hit me up. I already I already knew something was going on, but I couldn't answer the phone, you know. And um yeah. <clears throat> I saw his I saw his Facebook post and it was like, you know, friends really ain't your friends until they want something. And I was like, I don't even talk to you when I want something. Like, you know, yeah, when I'm saying. going through something, that's when I don't talk to you because I don't want to call you and put my problems on you. You feel me? Like exactly. it's not yeah, even that, it's yeah. like I'm busy. And I if I pick up the phone, you ain't gonna be able to hear me, you will be able to talk to me. But I feel like like you say, if I hit you up right now, you're like, bro, we good. You know, we met out there in that was it, uh Houston? Yeah. Oh, oh no, we was at nah, um, uh, we was at Austin in Round Rock, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you pull back up on the Round Rock, and I, it was like first day all over again that we met you. I'm like, bro, that go, bro. You nah, feel me? And yeah, I feel nah. like as grown people, we may not be able to talk every day, but don't think I got a problem with you because yeah, I ain't nah. talked to you. You know, you it's feel. just like not nah, just say, dang, she going through life right now. That's, how, that's how it is. Yeah, man, everybody go through life, man. Everybody got situations that they go through, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's all a journey and an experience, you know what I'm saying? Everybody take, uh, handle situations differently Big as face. well, you know what I'm saying? Big facts. So, and it's and we all growing at the mm -hmm. same time. As long as it's, it's always genuine and it's always, exactly. always pure, exactly. man, what's meant to be going to always be. It's you know meant to saying? be, meant to be. It's straight up, and that's and that and if it's love, love always gonna conquer hate. And that's you know what, what I, that's what I stand on here, you know, at the PG podcast. This is about love. And so if nobody told y'all today, because you know some of y'all are crybabies, so I'm gonna go ahead and give you that love. Nobody told y'all today. 
tomorrow or yesterday that they love you. Sorry from the PG Podcast, love you. My man yeah. Gino, grind man, time, everything. One K loves you, I'm man. To keep elevating, man. Love don't y'all, stop, man. man. You know what I'm saying? Don't, man, don't let these haters hold you down, man. You got some haters, man. Let them keep hating. You, Matter of fact, you, I make them haters. Into congratulations <laughs> on everything, you know on Hating everything. Into congratulations, cause you know how you do that. You keep going and you keep doing what you're doing, cause eventually, you know what I'm saying? They gonna see it your way. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? It's all the hate. Like, fade. Damn man, I was hate. Yeah, you know they was hating. About? They doing that job. If they hate, look, I feel like if you hating on me, you talking about me. Yeah. Right, and if you with me, you are talking about me. So either way yeah. it go, you gonna talk about me. You feel yeah. me? So Let just keep talk. talking, y'all. We yeah. need that word. Keep talking, okay? And again, we love y'all here. We love y'all today. We love y'all tomorrow. That's and live to inspired by inspiring to live. That's really what this game is about, man. And again, I'm gonna say it before we get out, go follow my man. It's grind time. Everything one K. It's your time. I'm talking to you. Whoever you are, it's your time. Go get it. And we'll see you next time here at the PEG Podcast. Let's get it. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. All day.